Hi guys, uh, Faith Brothers. What this uh, video is going to do is go over how to report social image spam. Uh, it's happened in posts as well, but mostly images because images are really easy to circulate. They take a lot less effort than uh, than anything else. So uh, spammers will create images and tell you to like the image in order to to get likes, and then they'll turn around and sell the likes uh, and subscribers for the pages and things like that. And they uh, they made a business out of this. The problem is that their business um, is affecting the usability of Facebook. And personally, I like the fact that I can communicate with all my friends from past history and, and throughout my life in one place without having to worry about spam taking over and ruining the usability of the site. I don't want to have another MySpace, and I'm sure you don't either. So what's going to happen is I'm going to show you here how to report what we call social spam, which would be any image that tells you to like it, tells you to comment on it, or tells you to subscribe. Those are going to be considered spam. No one has to tell you to do either any of those things because if you're using Facebook, you know you can like, comment, or share any image that you see, you see fit. They don't have to tell you to or remind you to. You're well aware that it's something you can do and if you want to. And it's something that you should be doing proactively and not by coercion, force, manipulation. When you see images of uh, babies that are... Uh, that are disabled and older people, and sometimes with comments such as, like this or your grandma will die, there are some really awful spams out there. And it's really getting to the point now that it is uh, more and more prevalent because people are sharing these images um, at, a, at a higher rate, um, not, not really seeing the damage it's doing. Uh, but the damage it's doing is that when they're selling these lights, they're actually increasing the popularity of this activity, and that's why we've seen more and more of them lately, um, because it's a service of profit, it's a profitable service. So let's go over how to report these things. I'm on the wall right here, and I'm going to go ahead and scroll my down my wall, and I'm going to look for something that says, like this, comment on this, or share this, and it's telling me to. Um, here's one here that's already been reported, I reported it earlier, so I'm not going to report that one again. And I'm going to look for the next one. And there's all, there's all kinds of them, so it's not going to be very difficult to find one. Here's a disgusting one. If, if, if this is not real. Um, if it's real, then it absolutely needs to be shared. But, for instance, this baby right here um, is obviously needing some attention and some help. And, and, and it's, 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 it's heartbreaking to see this. Um, it, it really is. It's, uh, it really breaks my heart. Underneath that, we see one like equals 10 trades. One share equals a dollar. Please don't ignore. The problem with this is, so thus far, I have not seen any article describing the situation, the name of the baby, where the dollar is going to, um, and the person who posted it is Cricket Updates. Now, if you look at Open Mess, you'll see that Cricket Updates is a sports league. And then you really don't have any, I don't see any correlation between this image and Cricket up Updates. I have not reported this image because if it is an authentic image, I would not want to harm the, 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 the cause. But from what I see here, it does not look like it's going to be an authentic image. It looks like it's an image looking to get likes for Cricket Updates page. And this is how the spam works. So, what you would do in this case is you would go in here and click on the image. It's hard to watch. It's hard to look at this image. It really is. And you can kind of see here that 46,000 people have liked this and 40,000 have shared it. Which means that this group should have gotten $40,000 uh, toward whatever the cause is. I'm imagining, I mean, I don't know what the cause is. It's just saying one share, one dollar. I would be 99.9% .9 sure that this is social spam. Um, I will confirm it after I finish this video. Long story short, let's say it is. You get shared, okay? And then you don't want to share it to your own timeline or to increase the spam volume. Change that to in a group. Now, in the type of group's name is what will show up. Go ahead and type in social. And here you see social spam reporting, stop the like images. Click that right there. Now I'm going to write something, but we need to find out is who posted the image. So you right click on the poster, copy the link address, add that, double click, a double return, and then copy 
the actual uh, wording that they're using that, that makes it appear that it is social spam. For instance, uh, you, so you won't want to see it because your window's going to come above it and you can't move that window. Just start there and highlight down. Shoot, sorry. Highlight down and then right click, hit copy, go to here, and then right click and hit paste. Now you can see, you can see everything that looks like everything we need, and then we can, we can follow up with the research from the group. Mind you, this is only going to go on to a group that is controlled by myself and several admins. It will not go to Facebook yet. So even if you get it wrong, no big deal. It does not have to be, you don't have to be perfect, because no one's going to be reported for something to Facebook until it's been researched. Hit share photo, and what happens here, as you can see over here on my right hand side of my my profile top, you can see there is social spam reporting. When we go over here, you'll see that we have aggreg we're aggregating these social spams. Um, I have a contact uh, within Facebook as well as many, many, many contacts within the industry. Uh, if you know what I do for a living, I'm, I'm very much within this industry. Um, but it's very interested in slowing this down. And, um, and so that's what this group is about. If we, if we aggregate these things and then I will do the research and show the proof uh, of it being authentic spam or the authenticity of the image and then you will be able to, as a group, we'll be able to report that to Facebook and they'll take the image down which will render the likes, comments and, and whatnot um, worthless. And uh, it just within a short period of time, spammers will get the message that these are not wanted on Facebook and it will deter them from continuing that activity. And that's the point of the group. So I really hope that you guys participate and join the social spam reporting group. If you need to join the group, you can go up here to your to the search bar, type in social spam reporting, and you'll see it pop up with the like uh, stop this the social spam uh, stop the like images. I encourage you to join the group. It is a private group. No one can see anything that you no one can see any members of the group, nor can they see any posts within the group unless they are a part of the group. I did that on purpose, so that, that way I would avoid any retaliation from spammers that might see the reporting going on, so you can feel very free that there is anonymity, um, or there is privacy, not anonymity, it is Facebook. But uh, there's privacy within without the group, so no one in the public will be able to see your reporting, and you don't have to worry about any retaliation from spammers or things like that. So again, I appreciate your time and, and attention in dealing with this matter. And uh, and we'll go ahead and and start uh, eliminating this this crap. So.